C language is full of questions. Interviewer may ask any question from C, and uh, you know if someone has done programming in C, he must be aware that there are certain things which are known to those only who have actually programmed or learned C thoroughly and with um, you know practical experience. So we would like to take up some of those like the interviewer or the Viva OC person may ask what is C language? So C language is a programming language uh, it is a standardized programming language developed in early 1970s by Ken Thompson and Dennis Ritchie for use on Unix operating system and it has from since then it has spread and it is the most widely used programming language C is prized for its efficiency till now the washing machine and various gadget use C programming because it is still the fastest and if you are, this question is asked what is the output of printf person D because you have already seen printf person D comma x then the x value will be printed which is which may be an integer but what if this you write in your program any guesses you know if person D x is there x value will be printed but if only this is there then a gar garbage value or a value uh, which is not known to us will be printed to the console and what is the difference between a calloc and a malloc uh, these are all, both uh, memory allocation functions so the difference are calloc allocates a block of memory for an array of elements of certain size see block of memory and it is by default initialized to zero and the way the allocation takes place is number of elements into size whereas the malloc takes only one single argument and which is required in bytes you know block of memory bytes of memory this is the major difference if you are being asked what is the difference between printf and sprintf printf prints to console and sprintf print to some array or character string how do you reduce the final size of executable so this is a tricky question there is a exe file which you make so how may you reduce it the answer is that you may reduce it by dynamic linking of libraries and this uh, they seem you know similar const char star p and char const rp but there is a difference since this is const this particular thing is const okay and here this particular thing is const const means i am talking about constant so in this constant char star p the character pointed by p is constant so we cannot change the value of character pointed by p but we can make p refer to some other location whereas in char const rp the PTRP is constant since this is constant uh, not the character this reference by it so we can make P to reference to any other location but we cannot change the value of char pointer by P and what is the quickest sorting method to use this will be asked for sure because there are so many sorting methods and many interviewers ask sorting and searching because here many things come like efficiency time all those things come big o small o notations so you know there is not uh, a specific answer to that but still if you are being asked to name certain of them then you can say quick sort much sort and redix sort they have a very good efficiency then comes why n plus plus executes faster than n plus one any guesses well some when I saw this question I thought oh, is, it, is it this really happens but this happens because n plus plus is 
only one machine instruction but n plus one is two machine instruction because n need to be saved to some register then addition and then the result so see that increment operation it carry out only one machine instruction whereas n plus one requires more than one now why doesn't the following statement work this statement does not work why because this is a string and this is not a string this is a character and character cannot be joined with a string you need to have this as a string you make it double code and it will be joined what is the benefit of using hash defined to declare a constant this is also a good question why hash defined is defined before or, or written before your main so hash defined you change one place and it will be changed in whole of your program program may be one line ten line hundred thousand but still one place you change like there is a theory behind this but I'll just try to mention that if you don't want 3.14159 you just want 3.14 you just change hash defined pi 3.14 and it will be changed in whole of the program and what is the purpose of main function this is you know this I should have uh, told it earlier as the first question but this may be asked uh, maybe later because there are certain things in C which are specific which are ought to be asked like pointers and plus pluses but some may start with what is main function main function it involves other function it is the fun first function which is to be called it is a static function and uh, it returns integer recursive uh, main is also possible it is a user defined function and program execution starts from starting brace to closing brace we have two arguments argument count and argument vector and whose name are argc argv may also be changed now this is a line or say that there are certain instruction what will be the answer because there is no comma ij but c what will c do it will print i and j because it will find out what what you have initialized earlier so the two of them will be taken here the first two if you paste person d one more person d then the third will be a garbage value okay then we come to another question which is uh, generally asked that i have i is equal to 5 then print f i plus 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 they are 5 plus plus so what uh, will be the answer see 5 5 but because plus plus is post operator then 5 and then 5 will be incremented because this will be executed so when i from here will uh, come into picture this is already 6 and plus plus will be done before the plus can actually take place so 5 6 plus plus means 7 5 plus 7 is 12 this, so this will be the answer so what is the dangling pointer in c dangling pointer means a pointer which is pointing to somewhere and the value has been erased that is the dangling pointer and what are the merits and demerits of uh, arrays in c see we can easily access each element of an array not necessary to declare too many variables array elements are stored in continuous or contiguous memory locations and what are the demerits wastage of memory space and it can only store similar type of data unlike structures where are the auto variables stored of course in the main memory and the default value is garbage value why pre increment operator is faster than post increment operator again when we see this question we say is it that does this really happen but this is true because in a pre increment we don't need to save the current value whereas in post increment you need to save the value increment it 
and then again execute the instruction so uh, because uh, some saving is uh, performed in uh, post increment that is why the pre increment is faster what are library functions dot lib actually you make a, a certain program then you want to give it to someone but you don't want to share the uh, code so what you do you make dot lib and give dot h with them dot h has function uh, declaration and dot lib will have function definition enclosed what are macros and what are its advantages and disadvantages macros are like functions they are preprocessor they are very fast because the code is placed at that particular location but what are the disadvantages no type checking is performed in macro and this may cause an error also the macro calls may cause unexpected results what is the difference between structure and unions again union takes a specified area of memory structure will take the whole lot whatever you have initialized in a structure it will assign the memory to every each and every data type but in union the maximum will be taken and you know every data type can work upon it what are the advantages of uh, using unions again efficient use of memory and same space memory can be interpreted for different numbers of union what is the difference between person d and person star d person d will give the number person star d what it will give it will give the address see example 1020 1020 will come but star person d will give the addresses once again 5 6 we have to print i plus 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 j so what the basic question is how this will be interpreted this will be interpreted as i plus plus and plus j then you can answer it very well i plus plus means 5 and this becomes 6 no worry 5 plus uh, 6 is 11 what is the use of void void data type void data type means nothing to return if nothing is returned then the void comes what is the difference between declaration and definition declaration and definition are same declaration does not assign the memory value definition does what is function recursion if recursion means function calling itself and there has to be certain point where you stop this recursion because otherwise it will go on indefinitely so see recursion calling recursion and what is the difference between dot com and dot exe dot com is quite faster than dot exe all driver program are in dot com out of have get s and uh, get s which function is safe Uh, actually both are not safe but if one is asked then f get s because maximum length you can input but if user enters then you cannot help it differentiate between uh, for loop do while and while the only answer is that if you are aware in advance that how many times a loop is going to run then you use for otherwise use while or do while difference between call by value and call by reference again call by value or pass by value means you are passing the copies of the value and pass by reference means you are passing the address so actual value will, will be changed enumeration enumeration is a data type also and because you want number uh, not to be there when you have you can have some uh, words so see enum like uh, any structure this is the name and these are the you know elements inside and you give a number yellow will take five value static memory allocation and and dynamic memory allocation this i will answer together static dynamic means at the you know uh, compile timing and in run time like in run time malloc alloc assigns the value what are c tokens every part of the program is c tokens like keywords identifier constant string literal operator and separators and what did, does this function do a to i changes in integer to character i to a integer to string gcut converts a floating point numbers to string what is file and small file file is a predefined data type but file small file is a byte of storage so thank you so much take care of yourself and happy interview and learn c try to make programs so that you are aware of what the 
प्रॉब्लम्स आ